Katie Nolan, Managing Editor and Co-Founder of Machine Control Online. And I'm here with RDO Equipment and RDO Integrated Controls. And here we have the new John Deere 850K dozer. And what's impressive about this dozer is from this point backwards, this is John Deere Electronics and John Deere Technology. And what they've done is they've designed an open platform that they call Integrated Grade Controls or IGC Ready. And what that means is that from here back and other components that we'll look at in a moment inside the dozer is that it's ready to accept 3D machine control technology from various vendors. From this point forward, you have the specific cabling, antennas, receivers for the particular systems. In this case, RDO happens to be a Topcon dealer. So this system happens to have the Topcon technology on it. But I know that uh, this, uh, that Trimble, uh, this system is accepted, will accept Trimble systems. Uh, I believe that Leica is also IGC certified and working, or at least in the process. I know Carlson Machine Control is also in the process of becoming IGC certified. So I like the open positioning approach that John Deere has taken because, you know, they build great equipment for different applications, but they also, they lead with a system and RDO does service, they do uh, different things to support the systems as far as training service in addition to the machine. So it comes with a lead system, but it also allows the freedom to choose. Maybe your company's already made an investment for GNSS technology, uh, so there's a good chance that the system will accept it. So let's go around and take a look at how John Deere has further integrated some of the other key components of the 3D machine control system. Inside the cab of this dozer, You've got, you know, like I guess a, a dashboard or control panel here in the front. And this has a lock and key, same key that goes to the back of the, uh, back where the receiver was. But if I drop this down, your uh, control box, your terminal running the software fits inside this compartment. This happens to be a Topcon GX60. And again, all the wiring harnesses, all everything, all the bulkhead connectors, what, whatever's required are fed into the back of this box. So, you know, really nice. And again, this, you know, traditionally, you have to take these out for theft protection. But with this uh, new John Deere, just lock it up and go. Here, around the back of the 850K, you have a locked compartment. And you have regular John Deere key locks here, and this just twists and opens up the compartment. Or you can put padlocks on it. That way the operator or someone with the company, you can keep this locked and then the people that are supposed to get into it all can have the same master key or uh, padlock it for better, for better uh, theft protection. But if I lift this up, inside I've got the Topcon MCR3 new uh, machine control receiver. And this way you don't have to remove these key components at the end of the day, you can just keep them locked up. Obviously you have the option to do whatever you like, but all of the bracketry is pre-made to accommodate this receiver to, com to accommodate one of the other receivers and all the cabling and all the bulkheads all are wired at the factory to be GPS ready or IGC compatible. Okay, up at the front of the 850K John Deere dozer, here we have Topcon's high speed sensor. Now this blade is pre-tapped for mounting this sensor. In the same sense, this is pre-tapped for Trimble's mast uh, Trimble uses a dual dual mast on the blade, so it's pre-tapped here, and I don't know if you can see it or not, but it's pre-tapped on the other end as well. This is pre-tapped in the center for Topcon, Leica, and Carlson because they use a single receiver and a slope sensor. So, you know, they've really thought about everything to accommodate these different positioning companies, and I imagine with their IGC certification program, you know, should there be should the systems change or should there be another uh, emerging technology or another company uh, that would be, you know, get into the market uh, through the IGC certification process, I'm sure that John Deere would accommodate those players as well. Mm -hmm.